so now here i will give the configuration so now i work in rotor one so here i can see your number uh first eight hundred zero by zero here one nine two dot one six eight dot one zero dot one okay then it will be on so after that i'll go the rip okay need to add here okay so here showing the green signal okay so now i keep the configuration here so i will go there desktop after that it will be 10 okay because 192.168.168.1 uh, uh, dot okay so the default gateway will be this one okay so this one is done so i have to go this one so this one will be one the last one will be one seven eight okay default gateway with a similar one after that i will give dna server okay so this one will be one five zero plus this it will be one five zero after that default gate will be one nine two dot one six eight dot one zero dot one okay so email server here also the similar way i have to follow so here uh the last digit will be two five zero okay after that the default gate will be this one so this one is done so now i have to follow the second one uh before i give uh first ethernet zero by zero so now i give first ethernet one by zero okay uh this one need to on after that at rip here you have to remember this one otherwise if i send one side to another side this one not work properly okay so now i keep the configuration printer so printer i have to go configuration first ethernet so here this one will be nine okay so this one is done okay so now i go this text desktop uh our ip this will be 10 this will be 10 okay this one is done after that i'll go there so need to go there the last digit will be 11 okay so now uh, i'll go there next stop rip rip will be the last number will be 12 then people get will be 193.168.10.1 okay so after that i'll go here so here will be so last this it will be 13 and will be if I'll get it will be 193.168.10.1 okay so now I'll go there next stop sorry just wait just a minute the last is it will be 19 193.168.10.14 okay so the default gate will be this one 14 down 15 will be this one you have to go there the last digit will be 15 okay default gate will be the same one and three dot one six eight dot one zero dot one so this one also done see here is the green signal also suppose that if i send one data to one side to another side this one will be successful okay no problem i will try again here so here's the successful if i send from here to here 
this one also successful so now i will give the configuration this side so i have to follow this way to go first with the net zero by one so which one okay here it's showing the green signal obviously need to add the rip here otherwise i didn't send one side to another side any any kind of data okay so now i'll give the configuration so the first is it here is the 12 if a gateway will be 194.168.10.1 okay so this one will be this one will be 40 40 okay if it will default get will be similar one so this one will be 16 okay 16 here okay so this one will be 18 one and four dot one six eight dot one zero dot one okay this one is done almost so if i try here i have to give the configuration here first need to go first it under zero by zero this one done now i follow first it under zero by one okay so this one will be one and five dot one six eight dot one zero one need to on so here is a green signal need to add here must be remember this one need to add here okay all right also done so now i will give the configuration here need to go desktop the last digit will be 20 okay then this one will be the last digit will be 22 default gate will be 195.168.10.1 okay so this one will be 36 so uh okay 195.168.10.1 36 is done i have to go there the last one will be 40 okay 40 it will get we the same need to go there after that the last digit will be 45 okay 195.168.10.1 okay so here is the this one will be this one will be 48 48 the default gateway 195.168.10.1 so last one will be need to go there first ethernet so this one will be warning warning 195.168.10.10.4 okay this one almost done so need to check this one is okay everything the configuration is here this one also done okay. if that here didn't show the uh disconnect need to add this one then it will be work so now i send data one side to another side suppose that here as some okay so this one first time will be fail so if i try Second time successful. So if I try again, this one also successful. Okay, never mind. I will try again. Okay. Successful here. So if that I sign from this side to this side, so this one fail. Because first time I need to take time. One minute, something like that. Successful. If I send here, this one also showing fail because first time will be fail always. Second time successful. So now this site is successful. So now 
uh, I'll go router 3 so router 3 I'll give the configuration first I have to go configuration and first ethernet 0 by 0 here. okay then 196.168.10.1 okay then need to on obviously go to our IP because always I H our IP here so this one is the turn see here is the green signal almost <coughs> so now uh, I'll give the first PC here okay this one 196.168.10.12 okay the last number will be 12 default gateway default gateway will be one okay then this one i have to pull on desktop after that the last digit will be 30 okay default gateway will be one and six on six eight dot one zero dot one then you take this one desktop the last digit will be 14 196.168.10.14 okay my default gate will be 196.168.10.1 this one is done need to go printer enter here printer number is 15 the last digit number is 15 this one is okay done so I have to go the next one, desktop. After that, the last digit will be 1616. Okay. So here is the 16. Then we need to add default gateway. So after that, I'll go the last, last one here. The last digit will be 70. Okay. And the default gateway. After that, it will be 18. The last digit will be 80 here. Okay. Default gateway. And then, it is the last disease is 19. So, I have to go here. So, 19 here. The default gateway is 196.168.10.1. Okay, so this one is almost done. I have to follow this one. Okay. So the before one was first ethernet zero by zero. So I have to follow first ethernet one by zero, right? So I need to get my IP address here. Okay, need to add also. Then I'll go the RIP because I have to add this IP address here otherwise I didn't send data one side to another side okay so say here is the green signal almost so I have to follow this one so the last digit will be 22 zero so gate will be 198.168.10.1 okay so the last one will be 34 okay so the default gate will be 198.168.10.1 so all configuration is done okay so now i need to check and another thing need to add here because here is some serial number okay so here is the serial number other side so two what is the serial number
so this will be then the last one will be two need to check again serial number two okay so here serial number between here so <clears throat> now I will send one side to another side I mean from router 1 to router 2, router 2, from router 3. I will check one by one. You know that here is a cyber uh, security area. There is a uh, office 4, office 3, reception area. Here is the office 2 area. And here is the office 1. Area. Okay. I also have DSP server, DNA server, and email server. So now I check data set one set to another set take dot uh, okay in a server here to here this one show successful if i send here to this set i'll be showing fail okay, no problem i will try again this time also showing fail no problem i'll try again successful here now I send this on fail this one also fail why fail need to check because maybe I didn't add this one I mean the default gateway I didn't add the printer that's why the problem okay so this one is done like that i send now this will work properly so here is the success form so if that i send this side also now it can success form suppose that from here to here if i send okay this is not working no problem I also fail if I send again. What is the exactly problem? I need to check first return on IP also have so why don't work. Okay, so I understood. Is okay. Why not? 